it is midweek, so let's start planning for the weekend. Yeah, here are just a few things to check out from our friends at City Magazine. First up, from insects to birds, planes to drones, swarms are the subject of the Mar Moss Art Center newest ex exhibit. Swarm features a selection of digital, sculptural, and site-specific artworks that portray the delightful and sometimes unnerving imagery of <laughs> objects and beings in mass, in flight, and all around. This exhibit features five artists' creative explorations of the concept of a swarm. The center's Ruth C. Horton Gallery will feature Multiply, where people of all ages and abilities are invited to contribute to the exhibit that allows participants to help proliferate thousands of hexagons. Hmm. For more information, you can visit artcenter.vt.edu. On Saturday is the Destination Diamond Crown Cigar event at Milan Tobacco from 4 to 6 p.m. You can travel the world looking for the perfect premium cigars or simply travel to this event to find a spectacular array of them, along with phenomenal cigar specials and swag. Enjoy a relaxing time chatting with fellow aficionados while smoking some of the finest cigars in the world. For more information, visit MilanTobacco.com. Also Saturday, hang on for the ride of your life as the Roanoke City Ballet brings the Taubman Museum's latest exhibit, Drive, to life. With two performances at 11 and 2 p.m., this performance will transport you deeper into how the car has shaped American culture. Choreography is set to tunes by musical icons like the Rolling Stones, ZZ Top, Johnny Cash, Prince, and the Beach Boys. For more, visit TaubmanMuseum.org. On Saturday, eat, drink, shop, and explore a piece of American history when the Thomas Jefferson Wine Festival re returns to Poplar Forest. The festival, which celebrates Jefferson's legacy as the father of Virginia wine, features tastings from over a dozen of Virginia's finest wineries. Funds raised by the festival support the ongoing restoration and preservation of the Founding Fathers' secluded Bedford County retreat. For more information, visit poplarforest.org. And for more on these and other events happening around our area, pick up your copy of City Magazines on newsstands now.